Hey, what's up guys? We're back with another video. Today we're gonna do things a smidge or a bit the same. We're gonna be doing a tier list! More specifically, a twice tier list. So let's go ahead and get started. All right, we're starting off with Twice's debut song, like, ooh, ah. Oh. This is a hard one to rank. I always think debut songs are hard to rank just because it was the first time we see a group. But in terms of debut songs, it did pretty well. I like the song, I like the dance, I like the style, I like the camo. It's weird going back and watching those videos just because they look so young. I did like the end of the video where it was kind of like a behind the scenes. The dance was there, there's the little like hip, th hip dance, I don't know what to call it. I would say it's one of the better debut songs to ever come out just in terms of K-pop. But uh, I am gonna put it as a Bop, obviously, first song. Things can get better. They're fresh. They're new. It was good, but not masterpiece worthy, but it was bop worthy. Moving on to the next music video, we have Cheer Up. Cheer Up. Oh my god. This is probably the first time I remember watching Twice. It was my favorite song for the longest time. It was so entertaining. They gave them their own scenes and they brought out their individuality a little. And then, come on. The shy, shy, shy. Thus. I am actually gonna declare it a masterpiece. Yes, it was that good. I feel like other girl groups try to do cute, but nobody does cute as well as twice. And they just nailed it every single time. That's why Cheer Up is a masterpiece. Moving on to the next song. We have TT. TT, I am just gonna put it where it goes immediately. We all know where it goes. It is a masterpiece. How can TT not be a masterpiece? The dance, come on. That's gotta be one of the best dances. Yes, it is simple, but simple can be great sometimes. This is one of the better K-pop girl group dances ever. It's just cute and simple. Anybody can do it. I was doing it. I don't know how to dance. So I have to put TT as a masterpiece. It really put them on the map. I feel like Chirrup did a good job of being like, Yo, we're here. Pay attention to us. And TT was like, oh, oh, we're one of the top players in the K-pop game. Moving on to the next song, Knock Knock. This one is going to go a little lower. I'm actually going to put it as so, so. It's hard enough already to make something great a second time like they did cheer up to tt but then a third time it's even harder i feel like they played it a little safe with the dance and the song it was a little too simple for me i feel like there was nothing that really stood out to me i feel like they also got away from those individual scenes that made the last two really work obviously they had their individual takes but they didn't have their individual themes in the background like they did before things i did like is obviously it was cute that little uh cameo from uh jwop was also good. Another thing I really liked was the little snow scene and the ending scene at the end where they were all like throwing snowballs at each other. When it slowed down and Mina did her singing part, that was, that was amazing. The song as a whole and the music video as a whole, I'm gonna put down as a so, so. All right, the next video we got up is Shigno. This one, I feel, is very underrated. The more I listen to it and the more I watch the music video, the more I liked it. There are a couple things here and there where the style is a little off for me. The alien boy that they're trying to bring back to, I guess, his home planet. And then at the end where apparently all the Twice Girls were actually aliens. Caught us off guard, but I liked it. It was it was a good little twist at the end. I really liked the individuality with the superpowers, like how Dahyun could duplicate herself. This one was a little bit hampered by the fact that Jiho had just come off her knee surgery, so they did have to fix the dance a little and tweak it a little. But I'm actually gonna put it as a bop. I feel like some people may disagree with that choice, but I feel like it's better than Knock Knock and it's at the level of like Lua, but obviously it's not masterpiece. Next up, we got Lakey. Lakey came around at a time where I really kind of started wanting twice to go a different route, either more edgy or more girl crush. It's still an amazing song. Cute, 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 the Instagram theme. That little scene where Jihyo is at the pier with the fireworks, just it just gets me every single time. The dance is simple again, but you know, it's memorable with the heart, heart. 
couple visuals where I feel like they overdid the cinematography a little, like Tui on the bench with the sunset. I'm gonna play a little bit safe and I'm just gonna put it down as a bop. Moving on, right after Leggy. Almost, what, it took them like a month or two to put out Heart Shaker. Heart Shaker! Heart Shaker, I love. I love Heart Shaker. Outfits with the white tops and the denim jeans, amazing. It looks amazing. I feel like you put any girl group in that. They just pull it off, especially twice. Again, when the song slows down with Mina and then with Jihyo. Twice slowing down and them just putting on their beautiful faces. They're even more beautiful faces. It just works all the time. Great ending with the little duplicates of themselves. The ones with the white tops and the jeans and then the ones with the more colorful outfits. But one thing I can't get out of my mind is the whole Is Sana Gay. As soon as somebody told me the lyrics sounded like Is Sana Gay, I couldn't get it out of my head. Every single time I listen to this song, I hear Is Sana Gay. But it is a bop worthy. I'm gonna put it as a bop. It is better than Likey in my opinion, so let's move it up a little bit. But it is not at Masterpiece, but I don't think it's down there with Knock Knock. Mary and happy this one is very tough to rank i was debating whether to put it in the video or not but i do feel like it's an official twice mv it's more of a for the fans type of mv this is not really a dance that goes with it or anything it's just more a christmas song for the fans but i don't feel like it's up there with the bops so i'm gonna put it as a so so i did like parts of the music video for example the gift exchange it just felt genuine the girls were just having a good time but we're here to put them in a tier list so i unfortunately have to put it as a so so what is love what is love came at a point where i really 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 wanted twice to go a different route again i wanted them to go that edgy i wanted them to go girl Girl crush. I really wanted them to just completely flip it on us and catch us off guard. But What Is Love is another cute song. I do like the movie references in the music video, Princess Diaries, Ghost, Pulp Fiction, Romeo and Juliet, La La Land, etc. With that moment when they stopped the song, Jiho walked up the little hill and started yelling her part. That was amazing. This one, I'm debating whether they're to put it as a bop or so-so. I know a lot of people would just put it up here as a bop. I'm gonna put it as a so-so. Obviously there were good parts of the music video, but I think that they play a little bit too safe. Moving on, we are going to dance the night away. First things first, Tan Ji Hyo. Tan Ji Hyo. I could not get enough of Tan Ji Hyo. I don't remember what performance it did, but the one where they did all white, I was melting, melting when I saw Tan Ji Hyo. Oh my God. I like the dance sequence at the end and I, and I really liked the dance. It was catchy. It was fun. It was a summer song, you know, we're just having fun. To me, it's, between a bop and a so-so. The real reason it's between a bop and a so-so is because of that rap. I know it's not twice as fault how the song comes out, but that rap verse, if we can even call it a rap verse, it was not good. It was not good. That it literally might drag it down to a so-so, but I don't think it dragged it down that far. I'm gonna put Dance the Night Away as a bop. Moving on to the next song. We got Yes or Yes. I really still was pushing for them to do more edgy, more girl crush, but then they came out with yes or yes, which I honestly didn't understand because the song was cute, yet the music video was like, it was dark and mysterious. Obviously that can be something that works, but I didn't feel like it worked in this case. It's probably one of my least favorite Twice songs. I don't even really listen to it and I don't really watch the MV. So I'm gonna put it as a Mr. Mark. I'm sorry, but it had to happen. It's a Mr. Mark. There were parts that I liked. The girls do a great job being cute. Nina's little English at the beginning, I really liked. I really liked the little eye effect that they did at the end of the music video where their eyes were turning purple and then back to their original color purple and back to their original color. But it missed the mark. It would be the one that I would want them to do all over. Moving on to the best thing I ever did. The best thing I ever did. Again, like Merry and Happy, it was more of a song for the fans. It was a Christmas song. So it didn't have a dance to it. But I really liked it. I really liked the part where they were in the movie theater watching old clips of themselves. It was just so heartfelt. I loved it. The complaints that I had about Mary and Happy were how the music video didn't really get my attention or how compared to these other ones, it 
wasn't really there and it was really because i mean the production wasn't there they were just in the house having a little christmas party but this one i felt like really wanted to pull at your heartstrings thus why i'm actually gonna put it up here as a bop it just makes you feel so happy it was simple but it was meaningful especially to once the dining scene where they were all having like dinner like maybe possibly christmas dinner those smiles that they had on their face those smiles they just made me like happy cry a little happy cry that's why it is bop worthy moving on we got fancy they may have not transitioned to a girl crush or more edgy they decided to do elegant which i didn't know i wanted i didn't know i wanted this this was even better they did something i didn't expect at all with fancy i loved it fancy came up to be my favorite twice song since like tt that's how good it was. The visuals were all on point. The dance, the dance is just iconic as can be. Fancy you. I feel like Chaeyoung stood out with the fancy you and the outfit that they gave her and then the little bob cut. But in terms of the song, we're gonna put fancy as a masterpiece. It's gotta go up there. The dance is too iconic. The visuals are too iconic. Sexy, more elegant. You kind of saw the girls showing us a new side of them. It was awesome. It's it's a masterpiece. Moving on to the next song, we have Feel Special. Feel Special is probably my favorite Twice song right now. Mina came back from her break for a little bit to be in the music video. It just felt so heartfelt. We got Mi Chang, the visuals. Nayo Jihyo, oh my god. The rappers was short, but it was sweet. It was good. And it really just made it once feel special. I have nothing but good things to say about feel special. That's why I am going to put it up there as a masterpiece. All right, moving on to their latest comeback, more and more. More and more, I'm not going to lie, the first time I heard it, I kind of felt like the song was okay. But the more and more I heard it, the more and more I liked the song. The hair, everybody decided to change their hair. It was a summer song. That's something that I really had to put inside of my head, that it was a summer song. Once I realized it was a summer song, I enjoyed it. Well, I am going to put more and more as a bop. I don't feel like it's up there with the masterpieces, but again, I don't feel like it's down there with so or so or with yes or yes. All right, guys, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. If you guys agree or disagree with my tier list, go ahead and let me know down in the comments. I will leave a link down to the actual tier list that I used in the description. If you guys want to go ahead and try the tier list yourself, go ahead and tweet it at me. Like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.